Nicola O'Neill, a veteran actor best known for his role on the final two seasons of Sons of Anarchy, was found dead on Wednesday night. He was 47 years old. A La O'Neill picture. According to TMZ, O'Neill's body was found in the hallway of her Los Angeles apartment this week, with all appearances indicating that he died very suddenly. The actor reportedly had a history of heart problems and was also a heavy smoker. Moreover, TMZ reports, O'Neill struggled over the years with alcohol and drug abuse. An autopsy will be conducted at some point in the near future to determine cause of death, but law enforcement sources say no foul play is suspected at this time. A veteran actor who has made a living in this industry since the 1980s, Anil is likely best known to American audiences for the role of Who on the aforementioned FX hit. He portrayed this excommunicated member of the IA for seven total episodes and even appeared on the series Finola in 2014. Ala O'Neill However, O'Neill's longest run on a series took place in Ireland's Fair City, on which he portrayed a main character named Keith McGrath. He had just been cast in a horror film called Charlie Lives, The Family's Return prior to his tragic passing. My good friend Ella O'Neill died today we worked together on the Sons of Anarchy My condolences to his family, actor Timothy V. Murphy tweeted in response to O'Neill's death this evening. So sad to hear of the passing of Ella O'Neill who played Keith in Fair City, actor Seamus Power wrote, continuing. Always enjoyed working with him. Rest in peace old pal. Thinking of him his family and friends and all his fans. Rest easy, added a fan on social media. Sons of Anarch logo. This very sad loss comes just one month after another Sons of Anarchy star, David Labrava, revealed on that his 16-year-old son, Tycho Spilicci Ucero, had taken his own life after battling depression. Never in a million years would I think I would be posting this. He wrote on Instagram in mid-May, adding at the time. This is my boy Tycho. He took his life a couple of days ago at 16 years old. He suffered from a depression we couldn't see because he was a happy young kid. I am broken. Elsewhere, back in 2012, Sons of Anarchy Johnny Lewis was found dead at age 28.